Konnichiwa Minasan and welcome back to another video. Whoa, whoa. So this video is just a continuation of part two of my last video that I'll either link above or below this video or wherever we put links on videos. So today I will show you and walk you through all the veggies that I will be growing in my garden. So sit back, relax and enjoy the process with me. And don't forget to like the videos, share them, tell a friend, tell your neighbor, tell a family member, tell your pastor, tell your doctor, your physician. Tell everybody and most importantly don't forget to subscribe and hit the post notification bell to know when I post another video so again sit back relax and enjoy this video What do you have there? Oh. First time? First time. First time doing the broccoli. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this is in my natural habitat. As you can see, guys, we have a nice broccoli, right? And right now, we're gonna drop in the oil. We're gonna drop it in the oil, just like this. So, there's a dig of oil and drop it in. Oi, crikey! <laughs> look at the size of that alligator. Oh, look at that boy. Look at that big boy. Oh my goodness, we get him in the hole. Yes. <laughs> oh no, I don't know that. This piece in for them, but first time, like, I mean, that's a do a thing. Freestyle. I thought that is life. Catch a vegetable alive. Oh my charge. Charge. Maybe 
girl say me name me George with a most of them for life. <laughs> what me I do with a name named George? Tell me, you tell me now. What me I do with a name we call George? <laughs> you real George? I suppose I George. Yourself, George, and you're right there. Big up yourself. You, you alone can can handle a name there when you're George. You can't do it. Me not have it. Well, I, I kind of project that these these will grow tall and not spread out. Unlike the cabbages. Where are the cabbages? The cabbages are here. Some purple cabbage, but we might have to move them, or maybe them are not too compact, or maybe we can remove one of them. Like you see, how you go now? I know, man, I'm not prof, man, I'm prof. I try, man, I try a thing, you know, in case you see. There you go, there you go. The apocalypse ready to kick up and can plant a two one and two vegetable and you know what I'm going there? Survival thing, you know? Yeah man, because you know see how you really go right here now. I've got fleet to the hills soon. Let's say what US US dollars are flying and everybody in a panic. Everybody are worried you now. Oh, you have more. You have more broccoli, so I'm gonna go to. Right, so, so, yeah, so, 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 Never tell a lie. Oh. <laughs> <Is> a... <laughs> what are the poor watching big up yourself? No, I'm not a lie. <laughs> Anywhere there in the world. Yes. They call me Farmer George. So what made you decide to start farming or gardening? Uh, I mean, it's was something that I'm, I've always been interested in. Just something that seems. It don't seem. I don't know. I don't know exactly, but I was always interested in it. But then you have your parents did farming. Yeah. Yeah, my father farmers, so yeah. I guess, I guess that's where I got. A little bit of it, a little bit interest. Given that I've, I've done it one or a few times. What did you do? Yeah, almost any, every, no, no, really, almost any. They think cash crop. So, like tomato, lettuce, potatoes. Yam. Yeah, most yeah, mostly yam, but like what the come on. Chuck but I tell it to Drop it in the hole. Because you know it has to go into a hole. So yeah. Snugs so are like coming up cool. So, yeah. That's that way. Treat them like a baby. Yeah. They are very tender creatures. Nice 
into the hole now and you know they'll, they'll give it the same, the same treatment same Hollywood treatment they'll treat it nice and thin <laughs> the inner one now So it's done. Alright. And then and this now. This is what it done. Oops. Oh, uh, I touched the garlic. So yes. So I'm so I'm doing something what I'm called now. Like I don't remember the term, but our companion. Our companion. Ship kind of agriculture where you plant more than one. I don't remember the term. I may get great, great to in the agri. We got myself. Anyways. Yeah. So, we have some companionship where you know both crops can benefit from each other. So, which crops you have in here? Lettuce and? It's garlic. Let me say, garlic supposed to deter you know, in insects. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Where oh, you come from? Which, which 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 bush are you, 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 you living in? Uh? Garlic water off Duppy. No, we not water off no Duppy, cause no Duppy can trouble me. So, uh, in this case, in this case, we are worrying of insects or or pests. Yes, to the to the to the plant. Yes, like some people. Pestilence. What you call them? Up and down, this. So this is a a piece of kitchen scraps, vegetable scraps. Where um, so, so it looks like a a cabbage cabbage scraps you know and I'll, I'll throw it in there for it to break down you know and add little nutrients and so forth to the soil but instead of it breaking down it actually volunteers itself to to grow but i don't have no space for you so therefore i, I didn't make the cut so i'm sorry so i'll try again next year i, I just We are finished planting now, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Don't mind them, I'm a bit camera shy. <laughs> but 
but so we finished planting now so now we are going to give them a nice drink and then we send them to them bed because it's not cool anymore nice so that for us moisten up them roots you know let them feel you know it's a vibe you know yeah Thank you. 